It was, it was stressful. We all missed him a lot. Made it easier because I knew that I'm not the only one going through it. Community representatives from around Virginia gathered in Richmond to participate in a day-long workshop for the Military Children's Education Coalition. The group focused on their various strengths, talents, and influences to support the military children of Virginia. And our experience with the Virginia National Guard has just been terrific. I mean, uh, Virginia is the second largest state in terms of military presence of school-aged children. I mean, this is certainly something that every Virginian uh, can see. I mean, they can see it in small communities, in the large urban areas. So the Guard gets that. Virginia community leaders in education, business, health, and religious and civic groups brainstormed various needs and resources to present local solutions aimed at helping military children. But the children of the National Guard and the Reserve often bear a special burden. Virginia's Adjutant General, Major General Bob Newman, and his wife Becky hosted the event. We have uh, almost 250,000 children uh, whose parents have deployed, are currently deployed, and it's important that uh, we come out of this conference with a plan that helps these kids cope with their folks' deployment. Uh, we know that there are certain segments that this conference is focusing on, such as adolescents or high schoolers, but there's also the benefit of a, of a large statewide plan that will come out that will be a benefit to all kids. Being a part of a military family may entail certain challenges, but the conference was also sure to highlight the numerous unique experiences and benefits. Because look at all you're doing for our country, and not just your dad or your mom or whoever it may be, but look at what you're providing for our country and the sacrifices you're making and how much we appreciate and honor what you're doing. And, and to hold them high and, and, and show them that you know, life isn't always going to be easy and it's facing those challenges and coming up with solutions and being creative and taking that leadership and you know, instilling it at them at an early age so that they can be leaders of our country down the road. For the Virginia National Guard, I'm Army Sergeant John Slosser.